Okay, this is uh, going to be a very short video, hopefully. Uh, good for us, though. It should be a flagship fight using the Rock B that has a two Flak 2s and a Flak 1. For good measure, we also have cloaking, mind control, hacking. Uh, we picked up Hackstun at the end of Sector 7, and we have two automated reloaders. Fun. So here's the uh, the flagship that's waiting at the base. I'm gonna have to jump there next turn before it blows it up. Uh, decisions, decisions. So I am have options between trying to get as many crew kills as possible in phase one or having a fairly safe phase one. I think I'll probably do the latter. My plan is that we hack missiles in this hard mode fight, between the hacking of the missiles and our cloaking, we won't be hit by them. Uh, then we have four shields and our evasion to deal with all the other weapons. Uh, and just slam as many flak into the shield room and hope to get crew kills as uh, possible. Mind control will also help in that so we can mind control the pilot, drop the evasion just before the flak gets there. And uh, here we go. All right, this is it. The Rebel Flagship. If you are able to destroy this monstrosity, the Federation fleet will have a chance of surviving. There is no turning back. All right, so of course all the space upon where this flagship is going to hack us and then uh, take our planes accordingly. They hacked our hacking. Not great. So yeah, I think we'll go the uh, defensive route with our hack their missile system. Okay. Should make a pretty good noise. <laughs> Okay, so I should have hacked off the bat then. That's fair. No, my flak! Alright, well, quick phase one. I guess crew kills aren't particularly an option since uh, my accuracy is going to be garbage with two flak. All right, we will have to wait out for the flagship now. I took a damage, I didn't have to take that. I'm going to set the base and wait for the flagship to come back to set up the phase three portion of the fight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I didn't kill much crew there. Okay, we'll go one power worth of hacking so we can turn it on and off, get past this uh, combat drone here. time. Ooh, that in piling is actually pretty nasty. Okay, so we have level two oxygen to uh, counter the breach that's currently in my pile beam. I'm going to send the NG to help out with the fighting. It's about the only thing I can currently spare. Okay, 
Yeah. So, uh, one, two, hack now, and uh, use the cloak for the event with a bunch of drones come flying at me. Yeah, and use almost toast. Send them to get healed up. Okay, we'll go ahead and cloak now. Timing for this event is a little bit off with the cloaking, so if we cloak early, we should be able to cloak like the second half of it. Managed to come back. They're not going to survive our next flak. Okay, let's put out the fires. The global drawers we have, they should not be spreading. All right, crank up the O2, open the doors, equalize the oxygen loss from the single breach. Phase three, we're going to jump into the flagship here. Uh, we're going to have a considerable amount of crew left over. So if things go bad, and because there's too much crew, we just take damage, we can jump back to the base. This is why we do this jump off strat, because it always gives us a safe place to return to in case things go wrong. Alright, phase three has a super shield. One, two, three, four, five, six boarding crew plus the pilot. Uh, we're just gonna use our mind control to counter theirs and can't hack until this super shield is down. Probably want doors closed. Probably. <laughs> Okay, we actually don't cloak under this thing of missiles. We want to wait until the event happens. Those normally sync up pretty well. Okay, that's pretty bad that they are able to do a damage and now we have fire, so our cloak is going to be offline. Going to bring in some backup. We might jump from this just because of the uh, loss of the cloak. Yeah, we're gonna run from this fight. That was bad that we got boarded in here, got hit in there, and it started a fire. Yeah, I can't let them take my pilot. Yeah, we're just gonna jump. Don't even know how those shots are going to land. So we can buy control these two guys. So they'll fight each other. That takes care of them. We'll take the two rocks against these two borders. So 
So the two engines to deal with the fire over here. Start using the rocks to put out the quad fire since they don't take damage from fires. Okay, should be under control now. Okay, heal everyone up, we'll try again. if they're actually in the med bay. And here comes the flagship. One border this time. <laughs> Three times through 48% dodge. That's unfortunate. Started a fire and took out our mind control as well. I'm just gonna hack their uh, shields. Oh, they had a little border there. I didn't even notice. Try and join their crew. That fires out. We just got mine controlled. Oh, my piloting. Okay. Can't have that. here the shit time with the event wow that was a lot of misses that was a disgusting amount of misses So we will actually, by moving the Zoltans, we kind of pull power from the system. Ah, more fires. It's a little bit gross. We should be okay with the next volley, though. Yeah. Triple flex. Pretty good. Ah, oh, just sub 6k. Uh, new high score for the student. Yeah, so uh, two flak twos, flak one, pretty good. And uh, I think I'll just uh, leave the video with that. Thanks for watching.